So we finally managed to get our fifth crew member hard at work, our hydro vane. Um, so our hydro vane is steering purely by the wind, uh, using no electronics at all. Um, and we're sailing from Porto Santo, which is a small island in the Madeira archipelago, to Madeira Grande. So um, it's our first time with getting the hydro vane to work. So. Do Lord, which is the eastern end of Madeira with a, an amazing volcanic backdrop uh, to the marina. We've been really enjoying our time in Madeira. Um, it's, we've been trekking, amazing mountain views. I think the pandemic has reduced tourism here so it has meant that things have been maybe a little bit quieter. We're standing in this beautiful resort just above our marina, which is in an amazing location surrounded by volcanic cliffs and it's completely abandoned. Um, we think maybe because of coronavirus, it's quite a remote part of the island in the southeast corner. It's just such a shame, it's just beautiful here and it's all derelict.
we only have 90 days on our visas for the European Union, so our visas are expiring at the end of the month. We're nearly there, so we're going to have to leave uh, pretty sharply. We're going to have a brief stop in the Canaries, and then we have to get out of there quite quickly before our visas expire, and we'll be going to Cape Verde before we cross the Atlantic. If you'd like to follow us while we're offshore, we'll have daily updates on our tracker, and if you'd like to find out more information about our journey with our gorgeous cats, you can follow us on the blacksprayhood.com. You can subscribe to us there. You can also subscribe on YouTube. Yeah. If you're watching on YouTube, uh, these videos are part of a weekly blog post, which you can find on the blacksprayhood.com. Uh, there we're sh sharing our learning experience. We're learning to sail as, as we go. Uh, and you can find out more details by reading the blog posts that go with the videos.